The seaside town of Huskisson, just south of Sydney, is like a warm, familiar blanket. From the incredible beaches to the Husky Hotel, you know what to expect. But I'm here to show you some new, cool places and experiences that will have you wanting more. Just out of town in the industrial estate stands the newly opened Jervis Bay Brewing Company. Paul, oh, this is what I call a brewery. It's amazing. Yeah, it's pretty good. We're pretty happy with it. What a space. Tell us about it. Well, we opened up recently. We had a few bumps in the road, but yeah. it's uh, really popular with the locals and tourists alike. So... This place is hopping, all right. Yeah, it's pretty good. We love it. Let's talk about the beer. All right, Check that's my favourite thing, too. OK. So the first one we're going to try is the 11 Days Pale Ale. It's made with an Amarillo and a Strata hop, and you'll get passion fruit notes out of it. Ooh, I am. It's delicious, fresh and fruity. Mm. Mm. And tell us the story behind the name. Yeah, sure. So in uh, 1805, the, the cutter Nancy shipwrecked off the shores of Jervis Bay. The sailors got on shore, but they had to walk 11 days all the way to Sydney. Oh. So we thought we'd call it 11 Days Pale Ale because, geez, they deserve a beer after that. <laughs> Delicious. It's good. Now, what's this one? This one's called the Broad Idea XPA. So it's, mm. that one is made with a uh, single citra hop and finished with a crystal malt. So you can see it's a slightly darker colour. It's very smooth and I feel smarter already. Bright idea. From the stories behind each beer to the brewing fit out and even the entertainment, it's a celebration of all things local. And let's not forget the food. A rotation of mouth-watering food trucks. And today's food truck is pizza! Oh, yes, Wes. Thank you so much. What's this? This is the local mushroom one. Oh, so good. Great beers and pizza. It's the place to hop to. No. Ladies, we are loving the beer. Lucy, what have you got? The XBA. Rosie, oh, the Pilsner. Caitlin, yeah. the Bitten Fruit. Oh, we're thirsty. Let's drink. Ooh. Your name's Swan, mm -hmm. and you are drinking the Swan beer. What's it called? So it's called the Black Baby Session Start, which is the best beer that you can have here, actually. And you win most fashionable in the beer garden. Mm -hmm. Check out the shoes! Mm -hmm. Oh, stop it! They're called fish flops. What do you think? Fish flops. <laughs> This place is amazing. Could really settle in for the whole day. But I've got to run because I'm off to meet a local who loves a bit of action. Hey, George! Hey, Lizzie, how are you going? Hi. Thanks for coming down. How are you? It's beautiful awesome. spot. Wow. Perfect. A bona fide local, George runs his own company, Sup With George, giving visitors like me the chance to explore this magnificent part of the world. Like the pristine Corumban Creek, Woo! We're here! Woohoo! Woo! In paradise, here we are. We're going this way. Let's go. And with George as your guide, there's a surprise at every turn. Oh, wow! Welcome to Koala Beach. It nice. really is paradise. Look at this. Oh. No today. It's like a dream. This is, this is Koala Beach, the longest beach in Jervis Bay. It's like this beautiful blue glass. It is. And when I was at the wharf in town, this is the beautiful beach you can see, but you think, how can I get there? Well, you've got the answer. Oh, wait, I have. Yeah, you can hire a paddleboard from us, from our shop on the main street, just next to the bakery. That's what's up. Correct. And uh, we also do bike hire, uh, dolphin and whale watching bookings. Get a snack, get a bike, sup it to paradise. Exactly right. Wow. There's more paradise just down the road at Bay and Bush Luxury Accommodation. And adding some European touches to this uniquely Australian property is French owner Flo. Flo, what a beautiful spot. I, we are set just five minutes drive from Huskisson on 27 acres of bushlands and the beach is just around the corner. There are eight self-contained and charmingly styled cottages, able to accommodate both couples and families. Guests can enjoy a private spa bath or hang in the lovely communal spaces. But what really sets this place apart is the cuisine. This is not just any normal food that you have here, is it? Absolutely. So our chef, Severine, is Michelin trained. Michelin trained! The food is just incredible. A French fantasy on a plate. Look at this. Guests are treated to a world-class breakfast, lovingly prepared and cooked daily by Severine. And for those after something romantic, a private dining experience can be arranged. I guarantee that the memories you make here will be lifelong. What a beautiful town. I am a Husky fan for life, Flo. Let's drink to that. Let's. Pop down to Husky and explore the jewel of the South Coast. For all the info on what's new in the Bay, jump onto sydneyweekender.com.au.